Hey guys, welcome back. Today, I had class. Um, school started yesterday, but I have a few new things that I want to try out. And God, I swear I'm doing something new every single time and I never just like stick to one thing. Um, I hope that keeps it interesting for you guys. Uh, but yeah, I just like dabbling in a lot of different things. I just like creating a variety of things. So, what has caught my attention this time around, this month, I'm still doing the Jasminite. I'm just waiting on um, some extra things to come in the mail, like a sealer, um, because I need to seal the Jasminite pieces before I put wax into it, etc. So those are still coming along. Um, and like jasmineite retarder because I want a longer work time so I'm waiting on a couple things that's why I haven't made anything recently um, <clears throat> just because they tend to get a lot of bubbles and I can't get them all out before it starts curing in like the five ten minutes that it does so we're just waiting for a couple items to come in before we can work more on those but while that's coming along I did a thing and I bought a clay machine and a thousand and one clays. Um, yeah. So I bought a bunch of stuffs, uh, mostly clay. Let's open this bit up. Um, some cutters. I have a thousand and one cutters coming in still, which is ridiculous. I need to stop spending money. Cutters, a uh, ton of clay, rollers, um, barrettes. I have earring posts, earring bindings, but look at all this clay. This is, this is just clay. And I plan to get other ones because I barely have any colors. But today we're gonna mix some clay. And uh, yeah, so let's get started. All right, so. First, we're gonna unpack this baby. Um, I considered not getting one of these and was going to just roll it out myself, but I'm terrible at that even pressure thing, so let's not leave it to chance. Okay. I don't know what to pull out first. in the bag. It's literally a glorified pasta machine. So realistically if you can find something cheaper then by all means. Um, I chose this one because it was also relatively cheap and there were some, it was like a half and half review but it wasn't too expensive so I figured it's fine if it breaks down within a year or two, hopefully not, um, that it's okay. Okay, this is obviously the handle. She goes in here and cranks out your thingy, clamp. Um, I think goes in here. It does not go in here. Wait. Oh, no, I lied. Go in here. Okay. So, you can use the clamp. I'm gonna see. I don't know if I can, um, because my desk is, like, coated. It's not really real wood, so it's gonna scratch it up. So, let's not. Okay. We'll just hold it and roll it. <laughs> okay. It'll be fine, she says. Okay. So I really am enjoying these two pastel colors and I kind of want to do, can you see these colors? Do they come up true to color? Um, this mint, I think I want to, I don't know what I want to do guys, I really don't. 
in all honesty I really wanted to get some more cutters in before I started doing this but I'm really excited and I just need to I just need to do it a day dangerous we'll keep that away one other thing for the garbage okay um on papier to wipe away debris okay um i guess let's cut this at least i wanted to try a blue Ugh, it makes a terrible squeaky sound that I absolutely hate. Oh god. It's disgusting. It's disgusting. Oh, that's a terrible sound. Oh! It makes a squeaky sound that I'm not a fan of. Um. <gasps> It actually makes me want to just like, it's like nails on a chalkboard. That's the sound it makes. Indigo Sands, I don't know how you do it. Okay, so I think I want these a little bit smaller. Okay, so it looks like that. Uh, we're going to need some gloves though. Thankfully, I have a thousand and one. Wait, now the question is, do I want it with veins of blue? Yes. Or do I want it partially blue and clear with veins of blue? No, I want blue. Okay. So, <clears throat> this is going to get messy. I think this is what you do. Okay, this is definitely the blue I wanted. Smells like alcohol. Great. Um, and I'm assuming we want to coat all the pieces as well as we can. There are still some that are not coated. Rando little bits. Okay. Um. Now the question is, do I let this dry? not to do when making clay earrings. Cut your finger on the cane slicer. <sighs> okay, Danjaroso.
Perdição, 